In search of back-to-back -back victories and a sweep of this two-game road trip, the Edmonton Oilers pay a visit to the Philadelphia Flyers on Thursday night as Jack Campbell gets to start between the pipes following a terrific 41 save performance where he was the best player on the ice in Nashville. The question to go with Campbell or Skinner was answered with a simple reason from head coach Jay Woodcroft. I like the way he played. Earned, not given. Is that how I started with Bob? <laughs> I thought uh, he earned another start given his play. He's also had a fantastic uh, six, seven weeks with the group here going back to his preseason. There were, you know, uh, the first game of the year was an odd one for the team as a whole, um, but I like the way he played. A look into tonight's projected lineup reveals one potential change based on line rushes this morning in Philadelphia as Vincent DeHarnay was paired with Brett Kulak while Philip Broberg was clearly skating as the seventh defenseman. However, it remains to be seen if Woodcroft will go 11-7 or 12-6 tonight. One thing we do know is how effective the line of Fogel, Nugent Hopkins and Hyman were in Tuesday's victory in Nashville as Warren Fogel discussed this morning the trio's complementing skill set. I think we're a work-based line. You know, we, all three of us work super hard. Uh, for me, you know, I'm playing with two elite guys. You know, Nugent's coming off a 100-point season. He's so smart. Can make such good passes and then you got Himes who's such a worker B, uh, protects the puck so well and for me it's just trying to get them the puck and uh, you know create space and work hard and you know we were fortunate enough to uh, get a couple bounces there. And Oilers fans may have noticed a freshly shaven Connor Brown in Tuesday's victory in Nashville. I asked Brown about it post game and he said and I quote I was on the kid line I just wanted to fit in prompting this response from his head coach. Oh, is that why that happened? I just thought he, you know, he looked fast out there with no uh, facial hair. For this TV, I'm Tony Brock.